Okay, so this week we're going to start talking about some of the actual components of the anti-inflammatory Mediterranean type diets. And probably one of the most important is the fat, and specifically the types of fat in the foods. And lately, luckily, fat is now not being looked at as the enemy that we thought it was back in the 80s and 90s. In fact, it's a critical nutrient. We can't live without it. And specifically, the types of fats are very important, and they're actually the precursors for our membranes. Uh, they, they serve a structural component for us, and they're also the precursors for some of the uh, chemical mediators in the body, some of the hormones and things like that. So I kind of think of it almost like if, if you need to make a key, you go down to the hardware store, and the first thing that they do is they try to match up the key that you want made with a blank. And that's what they're then going to make your key from. And so essentially you need the appropriate blank to be able to make whatever the body needs to make. And this is kind of where the different fats come in because they are actual, they're different chemicals. They have different um, lengths, they have different shapes. And so if you are deficient in a particular type of fat, you're not, your body's not going to be able to generate the key, so to speak, that that fat is the precursor for. And so that's why it's so important to have a variety of healthy fats in the diet. Um, and so next week I'm actually going to bore you a little bit with some of the chemistry behind this because I think it, when we delve into it a little bit more it'll make a little bit more sense and then we'll kind of continue to explore the fabulous world of fat. So.